people are getting new license plates across Northeast Ohio, some of them with creative names and catchphrases. But as it turns out, not all of the ideas for personal plates get accepted. There's some ones that, you know, you just can't do it. John Rutter joins us live with why they can't do it. Good morning, John. Hey, good morning, Danita. Good morning, Katie. Well, each year, the Ohio Bureau of Motor Vehicles has to sort through hundreds of applications for vanity plates. Their new list is now out of the ones that didn't make the cut, including some new political insults. In 2021, the Ohio Bureau of Motor Vehicles reports it rejected more than 800 submissions for vanity license plates. That's up 79% compared to 2020, which had more than 400 rejections. I often look at this report that I get and I wonder, what, gosh, would I want my grandma to see me driving with that on my uh, license plate? But that's that's not my role. Uh, you know, and that's not one of the criteria we use. So a vanity plate costs about $50 and you can get one by applying online or in person at the BMV. But there are some rules for what you can put on your plate. We're generally looking for things that are profane, sexually explicit uh, or advocate lawlessness. Last year, nearly 50 denied requests included swear words involving President Joe Biden. They don't catch everything. There are things that slip by, but uh, they, they generally have their, their thumb on the pulse of, of what those look like. But President Biden isn't the only target. Other denied plate submissions included insults toward Vice President Kamala Harris, Dr. Anthony Fauci, even Carol Baskin from the Netflix series Tiger King. I, I'm continually uh, impressed with how clever people are those when using, you know, fives for S's and spelling things backwards. And it's uh, a lot of a lot of thought goes into some of these requests. The vast majority of those denied fall into the vulgar or poor taste category. But if you feel you've been unfairly denied, you can fight it. And, and there's also an appeals process. If someone feels that you know, their plate has been turned down unfairly, uh, you know, there is an appellate process they can go through. Now, if you want to see the full list of rejected va uh, vanity plates, you can find a full list of those on our News 5 app. A 16-year-old John Rutter did have his own vanity plate. Uh, Dad worked in the schools uh, at the high school, so when I was younger and I was at the high school, you needed a way to differentiate Big Rudd versus little, or which Rudd you were talking to, right? So he was, of course, Big Rudd. I took Little Rudd, which, of course, became my vanity plate when I was 16 years old. <laughs> I like that. Little Rudd. We can't call you that, though. Little Rudd. Why not? Why can't we little call Red. Little Rudd? Yeah, Little Red. Yeah, he's Little Red now. Not Little Rudd, Little Red. Man, is it nice. <laughs> <laughs> it's just cold outside. Sorry about that red there, John. It is, uh, it's definitely going to be a cold day today.